Electronic balances are used to accurately weigh out quantities of solids and sometimes liquids. There are many different types of electronic balance, but they are all operated in largely the same way. A weighing boat or alternative container such as a beaker should be placed on the balance. The balance should then be zeroed or teared by pressing the appropriate button. Your teacher will give you guidance. The weighing boat can then be removed from the balance and the material to be weighed can then be carefully transferred using a spatula. Take care to avoid spillages. The weighing boat can then be placed on the balance to take a first reading. This process should be repeated until the required mass is obtained. If too much material is placed in the weighing boat, this must be removed. It is essential that this is disposed of properly and not returned to the original container to avoid contamination. Your teacher will give you guidance on how to dispose of any excess material. Some experimental procedures say something like accurately weigh out approximately 10 grams of material. This means that you don't have to weigh out exactly 10 grams, but you should weigh out an amount that is close to 10 grams and you should record the mass that you've got accurately. Sometimes you might want to work out the mass of product from a chemical reaction. As above, the balance should first be teared with a weighing boat or other container in place. This can then be removed and the product transferred before re-weighing. The mass obtained should then be recorded accurately.